Standing in the square in Berlin, I am one of several hundred soldiers. I am in the front line. We are standing at attention, eyes straight ahead, motionless. It is a very special day. Almost directly in front of me, standing in his car, the Führer, Adolf Hitler. The war ended today before it even began. By my that's the most ridiculous thing I ever heard. You see, if you're a German half-Jew and you're serving in Hitler's army, things can get a little confusing. By his hand. You see this hand? Fingers, palm, knuckles, nails. What is a hand good for? Well, I can think of a few things. Well, between 1936 and 1945 in Europe, one thing that stands out that the hand is exceptionally good at is killing. Maybe 200 Jews, women and children mostly. They stand in front of a deep trench. What some Teufel is here then, Los? Show me your orders! I turn to the young officer. His mouth is wide open in surprise. The second bullet from my revolver finds its mark and explodes through the back of his head. By my... My hands! I'm good with my hands! Wood! Metal! I, I fix things! Hammer! Nail! Saw! Everybody knows Shmuel Berkowitz. Everything I fix. Skill, this, I saw. It's a very useful thing. In Auschwitz, you will be a surgeon. A surgeon for the Jews. <laughs> Was sagst du, Jude? A man is brought in, in a wheelbarrow. German? What they did to him? His left arm is broken at the elbow. Bends the wrong way, hanging. I see the bone, it comes to the skin. I try to clean him with a damp rag. He screams with pain! First Lieutenant Christoph Rosenberg, a good son who studied Torah at the behest of his Christian mother, but would become a good German at the insistence of his Jewish father. Go figure. But the hand of the Jew from Bialystok, the one who could fix anything with his hands, had a special instrument at his disposal. A damp rag. It was a rag he used to cleanse in the infirmary that was more like a mortuary. It was a cleansing rag that he gently placed over the nose and mouth of the fallen marksman, the half-Jew. We am Lichman who say, Bechayachon of Yomachon of Bechayedachol Beis Yisrael.